All right, and welcome back to another exciting episode of Mind Test Gameplay of Swords. Yeah. Uh huh. <laughs> we are going to work on the fire station today. Yes, we are. So we're going to get right into it. Here over here is the fire lookout tower. Very nice. And we have the luxury resort over here. We have the oasis house in this direction. We have um, part of the new subdivision over here. So the whole idea is, and up here we have the uh, little concert thing that I had built, which is going to get redone and possibly moved. And then unfortunately, we have my little test area over here. Very cool. It found... That's my automated um, papyrus thing, contraption. Look at that. Which, in the other episode, I show how this detects papyrus growing, then it breaks it, and then it puts it in the chest. All that other fun stuff. But this is going to have, all this is going to have to go eventually or get moved because, and this marks the uh, railroad tunnel which comes over here to the train station. And then off in the distance over yonder here is the nature hotel. So the plans for this area are um, tentatively, big word, going to be, and it was going to be a house over here. I'm not sure if I'm going to do, I'm going to put in a restaurant. And the restaurant possibly is going to go right here because it's going to overlook this area here. And I'm thinking of like maybe three townhouses over here overlooking this uh, body of water. And then, yeah, there's going to be a lot of landscaping done over here. But the restaurant is going to be an, a like octagon-shaped restaurant. I'm going to try to pull that off. And I think that will work. And then over here, the road's going to continue because ultimately it's going to link up with the road coming off of here. And I'm going to have to figure this out. Probably take the road over here and then turn it and use some kind of bridge system because there's a lot of uh, strange geography here. <laughs> then, yeah, um, that's going to be a challenge to make that link up to here, but it will. So what we have here is we have the outline of the fire station. And then right here is going to be the police station and forest service. And you got to understand, this is a small town. So, you know, it, I was a police officer many, many years ago. And the rule of thumb was one, thousand, or one officer to 1,000 people. And I worked in a small town. We only had 19 uh, full-time sworn officers. Yeah. Let me out. Let me, um, okay, not letting me out. There we go. So what I'm going to do here is, and I always, I always see a fire station as not, not necessarily old fashioned, but uh, fire departments always have this look. Uh, that you see in the cities and the, the, you know, the old, pre, the old fire, the fire stations with the arched, uh, doorways and everything else and the red bricks. Well, I don't have red bricks how yet. However, this brick is the closest to what I want to see. So what we're going to do is we are going to stack this. We're going to stack at five for right now. Because we are going to see, this is going to be two floors. So, one, two, three, 
four. And hmm, four floor, and then up another four. So I need to stack this another five to make it ten. Hmm. And then what we're going to do is two and we're going to one, we're going to stack this five. Okay. So that's one, two, three, four. I actually went above what I wanted, but that's okay because it can be erased. We're going to reset our regions here. We're going to see what we got so far. All right, that will work because this level is only going to be one. And to solve the one issue, there's going to be the recreational part quarters. Oh, why did I do that? The recreational part of this build is going to be a basement. That's going to solve everything there, <laughs> sort of. So I need, what do I need here? A brick. And I'm already losing my voice. So one, two, three, four. This is where I want, I hope to have, I hope to have the building actually finished. Not the interior, but the actual building. Because I want to get an idea, and that's going to be the floor. So across here will be the floor. I want to get I want to get it as much fleshed out on the building part. And then one, two, three, four. We can actually remove one whole layer here because it's not needed. And that's what I absolutely love about working with World Edit is because you can visualize, you can make your ideas immediately come life. So this is also going to be, and I want to get the roof on. Did I just do one, two, three, four? Because the roof is going to be here. I bet you I just did something that I shouldn't have. That's fine. I don't want to I don't want to make it too high and I don't want to make it dis, disproportional to where it looks some some went wrong <laughs> what went wrong there's gonna be a fireman pole okay so one two three four and then the roof one two three four that's fine and this is going to carry and I'm going to use the wood however I don't want to use I want the aspen I want that one and that one but I have to get rid of something here why is that there okay that will work Aspen wood slab is what I want. And I want to recreate the... I want to recreate how I did it over in the villa. Because I really like that... That way of looking at it. So what these are... And these will face... 
And I, I don't really know how I'm going to get up to the second floor yet. I got a fire pole so I can get down, but I can't get up. So what we are looking at here is one, two, three. Oh, wow. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. 12, 13, 14. <laughs> I am all over the place. I can, I have not been working on this for 15 minutes. So two, one, we're going to stack that. What did I say? 15. Doesn't matter. If it goes out the back, then. Ooh. I did not want to do that. You guys should have been like, like you can communicate back with me. No, it was 14. It was 14. Okay. So we have our. And this area up here is going to be the sleeping quarters and bathrooms. So this can come out because this is the fire pole leading down to the, down to the first floor. And you don't see that. You don't see those anymore. Fire poles. I, I think those are long, long gone, but I am going to have to figure out how to get down here. And I think I got that figured out. That part will be figured out. So let's go back here. I want to get a roof on this thing to really give it some shape here. So, and I'm, I'm going to try the long blocks. So this is going to be a window to mimic the windows from the bottom. Okay. So how do I want to do this? And then I'll work on, I'll work on, um, I will work on the said Windows of the bottom. Now, this is going to be interesting. Oh, it's not going to be interesting. I really like the colors, these colors. I, I want to look at different style bricks, a more reddish, a reddish brown, which I don't have right now. But this fits this area. And that's one of the important things. So back here is going to be Okay, that will work. However, one Now I have to consider I have to consider how I'm going to hmm, how I'm going to consider doing this because I think that's going to be where that falls down. And these blocks, these blocks will just go away when, because it's all going to be open, an open type ceiling. But let's see how badly 
Let's see how badly I calculated. That's not bad at all. However, we only have I can actually start the stairway going down. Okay, this will work. Because one, two. There's one other thing. Man, my um my poor little Mac Mac uh MacBook Air. Take that. Put that there. And I want this to have I don't want any yeah, you see I made more work for myself. These roof blocks are extremely hard to place. They they tend to have a mind of their own. So you just kind of make it work. All right, so that's going to go here, but we need to flush this out. That won't work because that will. Ha ha ha. Hmm. Oh, perfect. So that's going to alleviate that. I don't know if I want to continue. Is it, I can, oh, I am going to go all the way up to here. So six, seven, eight. However, I want my position here. Oh, that'll be fine. And we're going to stack this eight, unless I made a mistake, which would be, would be par for the course. So we will see if that Ooh, not bad. So now let's do some destruction here. How do I want? Because I need. Okay, that'll be fine. I need. That made no sense. That makes more sense. So right in here, this is all gonna this is all gonna go away. So we are going to bounce around, give everybody motion sickness. Perfect. Just what I wanted. And oh, not bad. I didn't have to do that. Oh, well, looky there. Okay, so that takes care of that. And then there's going to be a similar roof on top of here. One, two. Let's get rid of the framework. I am going to put a roof or a ceiling in here. However, I don't know if I'm going to carry the wood from the other side because this is going to be the stairway that leads up. And I might not do a basement because this over here is going to be the sleeping quarters. And there's only going to be six. There's going to be six beds. You have, you have a washroom bath. You have two bathrooms up here. 
You have two bathrooms below. You have the fire pole. Oops. That ain't gonna work. You have the fire pole. And then... Let's take a look here. So this goes into here. And this is gonna be like offices. We have to have a kitchen. So I'm liking how that looks. We need a kitchen. This is going to be glass doors. Or some way to get up. But I have that roof there. And because I use those small block, I use, there's two different kind of roof blocks. See that almost... That almost needs to go down one. Yeah. Okay, so that take that. We will see how this plays out here. So what I'm doing here, these are going to just be my corner blocks for the roof. Ooh, I made a mistake. I didn't have to do that. Let's get the roof on, and then... Why didn't that do what I want? Now, I'm kind of not liking. I might actually lower that one. To put, yeah, that'll, that'll do that. Okay, so. Ooh, that's a first that did that. Usually they mess up. So these are going to go here. Then I only have to do a little bit of cleanup work. I think we're, this is going to be another half hour episode. Um, did I just do that wrong? Yes, I did. I could have probably just moved that. Why did I... What did I do? Oh, I know what I did. I know what I did. I made more work for myself and I didn't even have to because of the way that these long roof tiles now this this roof is going to be a little um you see i did it i did it again so there that goes there that goes there now i'm on, now i'm on par so what this does these longer roof tiles give you a little um not a steep roof as the short ones. Now you see, I did I do it there too? See, once we get that in, we can get a real good idea of what we have going on here. Ah, oh, perfect. Yep, I kind of figured that was going to happen. So let's go bit oop, that's not what I wanted. I wanted sunshine. And
because it 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 looks much better i have found so one two three one two three four that's more realistic looking and put these back and that gives me a chance to use that unfortunately I'm wondering if I can still because that that's two I can make it I can make stairs off of that okay so what we have here is Take out our, our little helper blocks. I call them cheater blocks, and it sounds so weird. They're not cheater blocks. They're helper blocks. So what I can do here is let's put some windows in real quick just to, just to finish up the, the look of the building. So we need these and those. And these go on. It's not the look. That's not the ones I wanted. I wanted the silver frame going. And it would be nice if I picked the right ones. So these, these windows are from the advanced uh, stained glass. And all the links to all the mods I use are in each show description. So uh, YouTube makes it hard because I still get a lot of questions on this. YouTube makes it hard in that they don't show you the show notes underneath, but there is a button that says uh, show more. And you can take that, you, you, you hit that button and then it'll expand all your, all the show notes. And I've also made a blog post over on my website. There, that looks nice. I made a blog post on the website that will um, also, it lists out every single one. And that is linked in there. So what this is going to be, these are going to be our garage doors. You know, that was very stupid hmm okay oh, are you kidding me there we go Oops. You know, I could just pick this up. Duh. And we just walk it in. Yeah. See, I had to change. I had to change. Um, I updated the vehicle vehicles mod once. How badly did I do? And it's a little too far back. I had to update the vehicles mod once, and that's when I had the problems with the drivability on certain vehicles. Uh, similar to the curling events when I drop something. But, that looks like garbage. But, certain other vehicles do not. Like, those, those drive pretty well. Okay, so let's take a look. Let's take a look at what we got before we call this an episode. Hmm. It needs something here like an overhang. That's not a problem. I can do that. I was wrestling with the with the the fact that I used five wide 
and the vehicles only require three wide, but you got to understand these are utility vehicles. I could have probably gotten away with four. Okay, that doesn't look bad. I'm, I might leave this one, two, three, four, five. I still say it would look better if I lowered that one. But if I lower it one, I close off any chance of doing, of doing that with the, with how I'm going to get down from or up to, I need to put, I need to put stairs in. That's going to be something I'm going to have to figure out. So. Other than that, everything else looks proportional. And I wanted to do. These are going to be double doors, but. Hmm. Doesn't matter. So there you have it. That's the, the basis for the fire station. I'm going to put some, I'm going to put some windows here on this side and then I can start the, and I, I also was thinking about what if I mimicked this side here over here for the police station? That would be kind of cool also. And that would kill all the, all the birdies with just one stone or I'm, the police station is just going to be a one story sleek building. And that one will have a basement for like a detention area. But the, again, this is a small town, so it's not really necessary. All right. So there you have it. That is going to be, that is going to be the fire station or the start of the fire station. And there's going to be some lighting some red and um, because fire stations generally have red lights and well, it, they have white lights and they used to do a thing where if there was a fire, they would change a light to red, especially during the Christmas season. So, and I'm going to probably have to move that doorway over to make it look better. So I have, I have some stuff to finish. Um, So we have one, two, three, four, five, one, two, three, four, five. There we go. That, that makes that look much better. However, on the inside, it's off because of the way the corners are. That's not a big deal. I still say I should lower that one and then do some kind of way up to there. This is going to be offices. It's kind of big for an office. It can, it can have an office or a desk and then I can put the kitchen and a table over here. And then we have, we have like locker rooms and washrooms here. We have the fire pole here. I will work on some way of getting a stairway up to the second floor. And I'm not sure how I'm going to do like a seating area, like a little recreation area, but for the most part, um, yeah, that's going to do it. So that's basically my thought process on that. And then over there is going to be a circular restaurant. And the real cool thing is to do that real simply, there is, we have the cylinder and I'm going to play around with some, uh, dimensions on there because that is going to look that that idea is going to be kind of cool a cylindrical restaurant but obviously in in mind test and minecraft it's not going to come out as a cylinder it's going to look like a um a like a turret on a castle and then it'll go up 
and then it's going to use these style of roof and it should turn out so we have like a crusty crab lobster roof over here on the train station we have parking there's going to be the road continues over here so there's there's like some parking in front of here and there this will get extended out i have a lot of landscaping to do even though not a lot got done so that's going to do it for this episode uh, i'm going to finish the roof up and then start on the police station for the next episode and also i have to do a convenience store that will be after the restaurant and we're going to venture out in that direction towards the concert area but this over here will remain untouched this is kind of an observation point which actually links up with the it actually links up with the tunnel so there's a service door there but this is kind of like a an observation point for the fishery or whatever is going to be down here but this all this area in here is going to be untouched this is going to be forest i'm going to add some trees because then we have the fire lookout tower so and all of our back in here will be all forestry leading up to this house and this subdivision and then i'm going to figure out how to make this road look believable which will come back here and tie all this together into one big happy mess. <laughs> sort of. So there you have it. Um, that's the plans. And we will go from there. So thank you very much for joining. Um, until the next episode. Goodbye.